Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. To, in today's video, uh, we're gonna learn basically how to make a PowerPoint presentation. Yeah, it's really easy. I mean, it's so easy that you can just do it in one second. So I think we're gonna just start now. Yeah, so first let me just see my screen. Yeah. Okay. So now this is the um, presentation. I mean, you have to go to PowerPoint. You, I'm opening this uh, in office.com, like right here. Then you go in this area right here. Um, this is PowerPoint. So now you're gonna choose a blank presentation. Double click it, of course. And now it's gonna load to uh, presentation. And we're going to just wait for everything to come. Yeah. Okay, so now this is the screen you'll get. You might not get this. Well, yeah. And also before we start and do all the presentation stuff, I'm going to show you guys... I mean, not show you, I mean, I'm just, I can't really show you, but I'm going to say that it's a MacBook Pro. I mean, it's a MacBook, it's not, um, like, a normal laptop, so it's a little different while you do it in MacBook. That's why it's more easier in MacBook, I think. I mean, there are more buttons and all you have to press in normal laptops, but this is a different kind. It will have a, a little slightly different kind of presentation. So, um, yeah, so let's just start. First, I'll just show, um, like, whatever is there to cover and all. So, we start with home, but files and all. This will just to be, like, saving and all. That's why we start from home. So, you get all these right here and insert you're gonna like things that you can put on to your presentation or your screen and this is like slides and all and everything i'm gonna show these things one by one so you would know what's the use of it and this is drawing you can draw on your screen and this is designs well, i don't use designs a lot it's not like so uh, efficient to me but people can use it so yeah and uh, transformations this is uh, like the things you want in between the slides like uh, when you're on the slide in the presentation you're gonna feel like that it's like a video so you know like in between, we you can put like push forward to the next slide or like this and cut and fade and all those stuff you can do here like animation. If you go to animation, it's the same thing, but mostly it does not open. I don't know why. That's why I don't use animations. Uh, and slideshows is play from beginning. When you are done with your like presentation then it's going to be like that and uh, review and all those stuff is just to check and uh, check spellings and everything so we will just start with home yeah so first basically this is our slide that you're gonna see yeah and uh, this is new slide you can click here to get an extra slide i mean a new one to create and this is like layouts, how you want to like keep your slide. Like if you want to give sections to it or you want to like plain it or just a title and all those stuff. And everything is here like if you start here then these things will appear like this font color and highlighting and all, all all those stuff that you mostly see and this is insert and tables pictures pictures is my favorite thing to choose but i'll tell about that later in the video so stay tuned till the end 
yeah so this is drawing how you can draw yeah everything so first you will get this blank screen right now and you just type what your topic is well i'll just say um uh i'm no topic well but i'll just write click lock fun Oh wow, I keep on forgetting. Yeah, so after you like write what you need, then you're gonna like uh, see this right here. This saves, like whatever you type, it'll save automatically. You don't have to keep on saving in each step. That's really a good thing. That I feel so well, uh, and uh, after you do that, you can write in small words like something here. Yeah, so yeah, you can do whatever you want, and after that, um, like you can put, you can go uh, here, design. Oh, no, wait. Insert, yeah. Insert, go here to uh, set a background, like, yeah. And you go to pictures where you can get uh, pictures from your device, like photos and all those stuff. And you can get stock images. That's what we, like, mostly I do. That's more easier. That's, like, just Google, but, yeah. And this is bring images. Uh, like, you have to select this go and go to google type whatever you were like, searching for and then you have to select it and then get it it's all like that but stock images is way easier that's what i'm gonna see like you can see here like all these photos you can get so click lock fun hmm what should i do art I'm gonna do art and you can already see so many pictures of art like they're art <laughs> art art they're like hexagons I mean there are more uh, creative stuff if you type it so you can see all these I'll I'll think I think I'm gonna take uh, this one this looks really pretty you have to click that oh my goodness what is happening that never came. Oh wait, I think these all. Oh yeah. You have to like, before you do it, you have to like sign in and all those stuff. Well, I'll just quickly do that and yeah, meet you guys after that. So guys, uh, the thing was uh, like um, I selected this like premium search if you select that you're gonna get all these kind of logos in the corner that are you have to pay for it but mostly when you click it it's not coming you have to sign in do something but mostly it'll come i didn't really know this was here because in my other laptop where i do it this is my father's laptop when i'm like doing all the stuff that's why it was so weird well, let's choose. I think this one is really pretty, which has all the colors. I think I'm gonna choose this one. Yeah, you can insert do at once, uh, but it's just like you can't, sometimes it'll just stick to each other, so it won't move. So that's why it's better to just like go one by one. Yeah, that's what I think. I mean, but it's just really weird if you do do at once. Okay, so select. After you click it, you have to insert one. And then it'll come. You have to just wait. And then all these options in the corners will pop out. Or might not, but mostly it does pop out. So, yeah. And also, when you go to pictures, then you can go to everything. Yeah, so I think I'm going to choose this one. Well, you can also set it by your own, but I think I'm going to choose this one. It looks really nice. But you can still, like, select it 
and it'll just come. You can also choose this one afterwards. You don't have to like see which one I have to choose and then do it. I think I'm gonna go with this one. It looks really nice. Yeah. Okay. Well, this. Uh, what do I have to type? And you can, if you have a topic to make something, then you might get an idea what to type and everything. So, yeah. Hmm, let me think. Hmm. Or you can just keep it blank. Yeah, if you keep keep it blank, then you um, you can't really see it on your presentation, so that's still okay. If I get something in mind, I'm gonna definitely write it there. So, yeah. Or I can just write. It's optional. You don't if you don't want to write, it's okay. And if you want to write, go ahead. <laughs> okay, let me just write. Yeah, I just wrote clickluckfun.com. Okay, after that, oh, you can, after I, you write these, you might get all these. I mean, it's really funny, like, if you write something and then you'll just change. And I love this font, so I guess I'm going to change the font, but it looks really nice in this color. But still, I think I'm going to change the font and all. Okay, you're going to click there. Wait, sorry. Yeah, you're gonna click here. Just um, click it and drag it. Or I mean, select it, and then uh, you have to go to you have to go here, right on top, and you can choose which one you want. Well, I only choose one. Where is that one? Can't I scroll down? Oh wait, sorry. Oh, I always use this one. I mean, not always. I have two different types. Yeah, I think I'm going to go with this one. Yeah, look how cute this looks. I love this font. And now, you have to click Command M. If you do it on Office.com, then you might, like, it might work with the Command M. Or you have to do Command Shift N. Just remember that. And then if you do that, you're going to go to the next slide. And then um, you get all this. And then you just type whatever your thing is. I'll just type art. Yeah. And you can also select and then write it. But I like to select it. Then change the font. I think it's much better like that. Do you like that one? Yep. And also, I'll just delete them. Yeah, there you go. And now you can, well, I think I'm going to keep the topic as art. Yeah, that's um, that's all I'm going to think of. Yeah, so you can type about your topic or you can, like, make new stuff. And you can just do whatever you want. And now I'm going to show you all, um, like how to bring pictures, how to make like a collage, collage type and you can write inside of it and all those stuff because then normally as I made this you can make this one also so you can just yeah do it okay now we're gonna move over here to get some stock images I love stock images okay so what are we gonna like what you could say like, oh, I want to see if it does places because I never like did take places and all. But let's just see. Okay, it does not take any places, I think. Wait a minute. No, it does not take any places. I think we can see here. Oh, wait, let's go to vacations. Think you're gonna get all these places? 
So, why is vacation with the, uh oh, yay. Okay, I think I'm gonna just choose this. What is happening? You can also go to icons, you can get all these kind of icons. You can like select and put, I'll just show you one of them. Yeah, which one should I take? I think I'm going to take this one. Select one over here. You're going to get this. You can extend the size and decrease the size. And now if you be on the middle, then you can just drag it wherever you want. And I'm going to go to pictures again. Stock images. And oh my goodness, the streaming thingy. Uh, you have to like close it. Okay, uh, let's go, um, which one should I choose? Imagine this, I'm going to take this one. Yeah, let's do something with the nature. Yeah, so these things will, might, like, these things might pop out. Okay, now you're going to just put it wherever you like it. Oh, yeah, oh my goodness, I keep on getting confused. And now you can bring more images like this. Like, oh my goodness. Yeah, I'll just do, I really, like, quickly, I'll just choose this. And then insert one. You can do it, like, two, three in one. You can also do this and all. I think I'm gonna keep it like this. And, like, more, you can get more pictures. Play it here. Now let me just drag that down. And after you see, like, there's no more text box that you want. So you're going to just go to home. Or not home. Wait a minute. Where is it? Yeah. If you have to go to insert and then this text box, you just have to click. And then you might get one text box. And then you just, like, how much ever you want the size to be, you can just do whatever you want. And yeah, I think I'm going to choose this one. It looks so nice. Yeah, or this one. This one looks so cute. Okay, after I choose, yeah, I chose that. I'm going to just type here. And I'll just decrease the thing I'll get my other thing over here down here okay I think I'm gonna decide I'm gonna just like you know then you have to type about what your subject is and then like that you have to make more and more how much ever you have to do and there are more stuffs like these, like designing things. You can click here to get this popping thing out. And um, new slide, if you click here, you can choose like how you want it to be. Like this slide has one line, it has separation. This has a little space to write here and here. This, if you're like writing something, like I just added a new slide. So it will be like this. And if you go and get more slides and all, you're going to get more and more things. And yeah, and then you can just, if you click here, you can get the bold option. You can type anything bold. You get the, you can decrease the font size just by clicking this. Or increase the font size like that. Yeah, it's like the um, shape and all. Okay, I think I'm going to just delete it, of course. Yeah, and you can highlight things in this color I'll just choose. And then you can, you can get the highlighting and all. And this, of course, everyone knows all this. I'm just telling just to show if it really, like, how it works and all. And it's almost just like the same thing. Oh wow, what is that? Hmm. I think I'm now, I'm 
I'm gonna just choose some other color or no color, yeah. You can just choose no color, okay. And now, um, this is like all the things you would like to, like with your phone and all. This is like fill color. You have to select something. You can fill the color, whichever you call, color you want. I'll just choose this. You, then you can type on it whatever you want. It's like that. So, or you can do one more stuff. You can like, uh, you can go to Google. If you have something with the like tourism and all like places, you might get any subject like base places. You have to make a presentation on pla places. <laughs> but I also got a presentation to make in school. Well, uh, you can like go to Google search uh, about it about the place you're gonna put first and then you might get a like um, a short brief yeah a brief about like a place and all you can just select it you have to press command c to like select i mean copy it and then you have to come to this place and then you have to click here then control v yeah, so in, I'll just type, or wait a minute, I'll just show. I don't think so it works here, but I selected this. And now you have to do Command C. And then you come here, click here, Command V. And you might get that same thing. That's how you like do it. So it'll make your work more easier. And yeah, most of the people also do it like that. And then you can just create more and more slides. And uh, well, I'll tell all the commands that I used here. So first, if you're um, doing it, it's like a quick re recap. So if you're doing it in office.com, it's way easier. Yeah. If you're doing it there, you can, you have to click command M for a new like slide and uh, you have to for copying you know you have to uh, you have to do command c and command v like command c to select it command v to drop it where you have to do and uh, yeah and if you're not using uh, this program i mean like office.com you have to do for your new slide you have to click command shift n that'll help you um yeah and insert and everything now we just have to put the these you have to select this and also one more thing you can drag this to this number so then i'll just like you know like change automatically yeah, so I'm going to click this and you can choose whatever you want. I'll do fade and this art. You can do um, like a push up. You can do different stuff. Stuff and then an animation. You don't have to go to animation. Wait, so slight. Yeah, review. Oh my goodness, where? Yeah, you can also add this in, uh, thing. You have to click it and it'll automatically read what you read. I mean what you wrote down and all. Let me just see. Hmm, it must be here. Oh wait, review. Yeah. <laughs> Right, I'm gonna just click this. I'll just show how the reader is. Yeah, you have to go to a uh, slideshow and then you have to play from beginning and then you get all everything. Hmm. So these are all the stuff you get. Yeah, you'll just go to slideshow, play from beginning. You'll go to the whole screen and uh. 
and you'll get everything I wrote. I mean, yeah, you get it, right? Yeah, and then my just slide just ended because I didn't write anything else. So I'm just going to uh, go back. Yeah. So that's... Wait a minute. Yeah. So this is all you could do. And also, you, as you just saw, it was looking really nice. And you can also tell in the comments how you did it or you tried it or not. And... Yeah, it's like very easy. You can, after you do this once when you start, it might feel a little hard. But if after you do it, like it'll be easy. Yeah, I think so. It's gonna be really easy and uh, just gonna be not hard. <laughs> you have to just try, and if the second try, you might just get it. You might do 12 or 24. Once I did 27 slides, that was like a program -ish. <laughs> So, yeah, and also, that's all you have to do for a slide. And then you just have to go here, the save. You have to go here, name your file. Like, I'll just name it, um... I just name it my name. <laughs> oh wait, sorry. <laughs> Why is there? Yeah. And then you just like do that and then wait there. Yeah, and then you go here. You go to save as whatever you want like download it as if you are submitting it to any other thing you you have to download it as pdf or like download it as images or you get all the things you have to do i think i'm gonna download it as a pdf yeah now this is just a, another question and then just download it and just get downloaded right here as you saw and then you are of course done with your slides and yeah and um, yeah and that's all for this video and also don't forget to like share and subscribe my channel click clock fun and do not forget to click the bell icon to get notified whenever i post a new video so till then bye meet you in the next video